guys. This is Scott here again with Vantage Coaching. So now what we're going to do is we're going to do an incantation with Matt. And as I was just uh, going over what an incantation is, it's really it's just speaking out what you really want to accomplish, speaking out your intention, speaking out beliefs about yourself. And when you speak out your intentions and your beliefs about yourself, speak them out with authority, speak them out as affirmations, and speak them out as if they are. So it's a belief of something that you may not see right now, but you're speaking as if you actually can see it. All right, so here we go. We're going to talk about affirmations and incantations now with Matt. Start out, Matt. There's a lot of people that care about you and love you. They see that you, through your struggles, through your, um, I guess, toils and tribulations, um, that you have been very strong. You have come through amazingly the way your dad says. Um, that your mom says that you're her hero. I believe in you. I believe you can do great things if you, if you believe in yourself. I believe that, um, you know, you've overcome a lot in life. You haven't had any of your life. You've had stuff that's been hard to happen to you since you were a child. But somehow, you've overcome it all, and you've overcome the pneumonia, you've overcome the things that people have thought about you and said about you, and I believe in you. You know, I don't always feel the greatest, but nobody always feels the greatest. Sure, you have flaws. You have, you have a simple nature. Everyone has a simple nature. We're all, we're all pretty much the same. Um, I believe that that you're intelligent. Mm -hmm. um, other people say so. Um, I believe that you have gifts. I believe that, um, in life. I'd like to write more. I'd like to go to school for a long time. You know, learning from different people things about the Christian life. I thought that believing in myself was the wrong thing to do. Because I thought that self is that part of the soul. That it's selfish. It's self-centered and wrong. But now I know that believing in yourself is empowering yourself to overcome. You do great things. And, and normal, well not normal, but things that benefit yourself and benefit for others and cause you to be a blessing to yourself and giving God the glory and, and praying to God and allowing God to be trusting God to work in your life and, and, and giving him almost permission and, and opening the door for him to work that's the right thing to do because if you ask God to do something, he'll do it in his way. If you pray for a family member or a friend or an enemy, that gives God the ability to open the door and work that way. Mm -hmm. So overall, I, you know, I'm, I'm never, ever, ever on this earth going to be sinless. I'm always going to have faults, but I can overcome them. I would like to be a counselor or a social worker. I have a long road ahead of me. I know that it's horrible as my health is. I need to quit smoking. So here we go. Well, thank you very much for watching. Once again, I'm Scott with Abundance Coaching. Stay tuned for more.